This is gonna be a very interesting video. Well, this brightness is a little bit high. We're here at the office house and we got Leon in here. Yeah, I, I just uh, picked him up a few hours ago. We've been having some fun, got Subway, and literally uh, just been having a great time. I'm gonna have him introduce himself. I'm gonna link his channel down below. But he's now, I guess, kind of up there as one of the official kind of top-ranked students, which is which is absolutely insane, by the way. Congratulations. Oh, yeah. thank you, thank you. That's crazy. He's gonna be one of the uh, the confirmed millionaires as well. But I'm gonna let him give a little background on himself. We're gonna you know do a little bit of advice from him and his perspective on everything. You know, on Facebook ads primarily because that's what he does. But I will let him kind of. Take it away with who he is, where he's from, because we got some similarities. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on? I'm just kidding. It's not my channel. But Energy, my baby. Name is Leon Green, man. I'm from Minnesota, just like this guy over here. So, like, you know, that's. He a, understands the snow. It saying. sucks. Like, I, hate this, I hate the snow, so I came over here. With, but I started dropshipping February 2018, and the first video I saw was Hayden's video, and then I was like, you know, right. I was like, you know what? Let me dig into it, and I started watching all the YouTube videos. All of it, and then when I started making a little bit of money, I was like, "Yo, let me get one of his courses or whatever." And you know, now we're here. You, you there we go. That easy. Hell yeah! All right, define here. I want to make sure we make it very clear. You know, I, I know you don't have to give like specific numbers if you don't want. Uh, we've kind of shared a few things, but what sort of numbers you're hitting, and also like give a little bit of the time frame. We'll, we'll show some numbers here. I don't know if we can get that to pop up there. How, Boom. How okay. about that? That's, those are the kind of numbers. And keep in mind, that's this month in January. That's January so far. Yeah, January. when we're filming this. This is like the last day in January. Um, Chinese New Year is why that. That's why it's declining. <laughs> and I didn't even start January 1st, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and that was more of like, a, yeah, so that was definitely like, you know, yeah. something that could have been, you know, probably 250 in the oh, month. Yeah. So that was your first six figure month. Yeah, and then one of my other stores did like 50, so. That was that. So a little bit over 200. That's nice. Yeah. Something around there. So, cool. So you know what? When, when did you get started? I know you said you've been doing it for about a year, but kind of when did everything start picking up for you? Uh, about July. So I started like the whole process in February 2018, and then in July, you know, 2018, found the product on Facebook. Kind of used free traffic to gain some traction and get some money to start running, you know, Facebook ads or whatever. Hell yeah. Okay. So about one year exactly. Oh yeah. About okay. One year. And so when did, you know, I know obviously you had to get the money first and obviously learn it too. When did the money start kind of coming in? The money, the actual like, oh, I could do, I could do, you know what I'm saying? It started, <laughs> started coming in September. So September, October, November, December, you know, January, it's just been going up. Never declined so far. So. Boom. Continuing to scale, getting those uh, multiple income streams as well. We got Matt headed over to the railing. He's about to fall or some shit. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I want him to give a little background on Facebook specifically. We can actually grab a marker and use the whiteboard too, if necessary, which is why we've got a whole room full of them here as well. Hey, keep it down over there. Anyways, um, you know, you do Facebook specifically. So you, yeah. s you started with influencers though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's the interesting thing here, doing Instagram influencers, which by the way, if some of you know, you, you've been following for a while, that's what I did. Okay, I first started with Instagram influencers, and that's where I started making some money because I failed with Facebook very heavily. I'm sure you spent a lot of money on Facebook. It didn't work enough until it worked. <laughs> yeah. <More than> enough. <laughs> I feel that. Okay, so if you want to give them a little, you know, a couple pieces of advice on Facebook, like how you got into it, maybe a couple of things, because you know it's been fairly recent. But what you did in the beginning that started working with Facebook might be a little bit different than what you're doing now. One thing is, I know a lot of people like always say this whenever they DM me or whatever, they're scared to spend money, okay? That's one thing I, you know, had to block out my head, S like stop being scared and just literally test, you know what I mean? So that's one thing that I focused on. Then I started doing, you know, I go straight to purchase conversions after, you know, watching everything. <laughs> I, know, I, know, I know, but. <laughs> it works though, it works. It's a different, different strategies. But, yeah. Oh, this marker like doesn't work, so you know what? He goes, we're gonna write that down, straight to purchase. Straight to purchase. And did you start with that right away? Yes, I never like did anything else, I just wanted it. Jeez, man, why do you go against me like that? <laughs> scared to spend money. Okay, and I'm sure you spend a lot more money now testing than you did when you were first like getting started, because oh, yeah. now you have the money, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so what, what is testing for you? Like, when was the last time? Are you still doing the same product that you were starting with, or is it Yes, different? now I'm testing something new again. So right now, I test with $20 per ad set to start, but you definitely don't have okay. to do that. 
I just like to do it fast and quick, kind of like this guy. Yes, yeah, sir. So that's the way to do it. I mean, a lot of people do five. I still do five dollar day yeah. ads. Like now, right when I start, like I just do as many five dollar day ads as I can on every single interest yeah. individually. So like you know, let alone for a couple it days. It's like works. it's whatever, personal thing. But, but you have to definitely be patient if you're doing five dollar ads. It's gonna exactly, it's gonna take a little bit longer. Yeah, like a little bit longer. that's why I literally each store like that I start it takes me like 15, 20 minutes a week after yeah, exactly. just basic breakdowns. Oh yeah. But yeah, okay, so straight to purchase. That started working for you right off the bat. Did you have a couple stores or products that failed? What did that look oh, yeah. like? At first, I definitely failed with like, I'm not gonna lie, over 10 stores, okay? I was just trying any and everything and then I started a general store to kind of like, you know, test a lot on, like so I could test anything on the general store. And then when I'd find a winner, I will go create like a branded store around it. And then that started working. And then, you know, that was it from there. Just Straight to purchase. If an ad set is you know uh, uh, profitable, duplicate it, double the budget, and then when I get to around forty dollars and I'm going to like sixty, I duplicate it three times, and then my turn in the morning. If all of them are doing great, then I'll keep it. If one is doing great, which is most likely what's going to happen, kill the others, then yeah. kill the other two, and then just keep scaling. Boom! There we go. Yeah. So, how long does it take you to build a store when you were building those 10? Because a lot of people are gonna hear 10 stores. Some people say, oh, I built like 10 stores. No, he built 10 stores. And doing 10 stores in 12 months, you know, it's probably a full day to set everything up, do research. Oh, yeah. That's 10 stores. There goes 10, 15 days you know, out of like a year. So, that's a lot of things. You know, you're flying through it. You actually told us when we were at Subway or whatever that you had one store, or no, as well, we were here earlier. You had one store, day one, it got two purchases. Oh yeah. Oh. And then he's like, oh no, it's not fast enough. Kills the product, kills the store, goes to something. I was like, and you said the product then like a few months later had like 15,000 orders yeah. on Alley. So don't have, shiny, <laughs> don't have shiny eye syndrome, be patient. Because if I was patient, I would have been successful pretty much from the beginning, but yeah. Okay, and I know you said when you were first starting, which is why you didn't get in the program right away. By the way, he went through the HSD program. Yeah. Um, you said you didn't really have any money, so you started yeah. watching the videos and using like free traffic methods. For those of you who don't want to spend a lot of money right away or who don't have it, what did that look like for you? How were you able to do that with very minimal amounts of money? Okay, so for me, what happened was there was a post on Facebook, like a regular person posted on Facebook, and it was going viral, but me and the girl I was dating at that time, you know, she was kind of into e-commerce or whatever. So we found, we thought about it like, okay, the product, we can find this on AliExpress. So we went on AliExpress, it was on AliExpress. As soon as we found it, we threw it in our store, and then I'd comment the link like, hey, I got this from this website on the post that was going viral. She'll do it, I'll hit up my homies, she'll hit up homies. So it was just our link in that post, and then, you know, you can imagine, no ad spend, and it was just amazing. That so commenting on a post, defined viral, was it getting like, you know, a million views, 10 million, was there 100,000 likes? It was a picture, so it was like, it was at almost 100,000 likes. Okay. Like, it went all the way up there. And so you had like 10, 15 people comment on it? Oh yeah. Okay, and how, how many sales was that, was that translated? The sales were like, for back then, it was like $600 a day, no ad spend. You know wow. I mean? So that was pretty And cool. that's, you know, pure margin besides the, exactly. the product. Exactly. And how much were you selling the product for? Selling it for $19.99, and we're getting it for like eight bucks. So that was pretty good. That is a great way. I've never personally done that, but there you go. Oh, Please yeah. don't go commenting on my Instagram. That's what they're like. People do that. Anyways, but yeah, hey, it's it's hilarious. Nowadays it's it's a little different because of you know how people feel about certain things on Facebook, but you can still definitely do it. Yeah, I know a lot of people try to comment. Have you tried commenting links in a Facebook group at all? Because yeah. people they'll, they'll just kick you out of the group. Oh, yeah, you know, you gotta be right. careful. You gotta do it like subliminally, build some value, build a reputation in there. So it's, it is a lot of work, which is why I recommend just getting a little bit of money, you know, being able to jump in. So now, you know, actually first of all, after that, then once you got in the program, what did it look like for you to take it to the next level? Because there's a massive jump between doing six hundred dollars a day and even doing three thousand a day, let alone seventeen thousand. Yeah. You know, what, what are you at today? You're like three, four Today I'm at, you know, let's see. Let's check, live, live, live. sales. Block out any names, if it's gonna show it. <laughs> let's see, today we're at 4.2. I started running these ads like 4 4.2, so there you go, like at 4 a.m. Almost a full day. Yeah, and okay. Chinese New Year, so. Chinese New Year's screwing it up. We're kind of like just coasting. It's mushy. <laughs> but it's okay. Okay, so what that looked like for you, you know, once you started getting a little bit of the capital, got a little bit more information in the program, like, because that was on Facebook ads. Yeah. So now you started running Facebook. You had, like, you know, a couple grand to work with or whatever. What did that start looking like for you? What do you mean, what did it start looking like? Like, was it pretty quick? How long did it oh, take okay. you? Because you, you weren't running Facebook ads because you didn't have the money. Right. You were doing the free traffic no, strategies. When I initially started running Facebook ads, it was 
a disaster, you know what I mean? People don't really understand, but you do need to understand certain little things. And in the HSD course, I know I go straight to purchase and stuff, but... Which is fine, I still do that yeah, sometimes, but... Fine. But if you do follow what he says in that course of, you know, view content, you know, add to cart, work your way up. I did try that initially, and I saw it working, but, you know, I just didn't know enough yet. But it's... You just have to be consistent and stay learning, and then you'll get to a point where you're going to grasp it and just understand it and just... You know, which might take a couple months. Yeah, that, yeah, that took, took me a couple months. For sure. So after you got in the program, which went roughly kind of halfway through the year probably? Yeah. Okay, so it was like three months or so to really start getting that, that pop oh, with yeah, Facebook. Yeah. And so how much were you spending on ads? Because I know when I first started, I spent five grand. I got one sale for thirteen ninety five, which was probably the worst possible situation. I probably ran through almost two grand for sure. Almost two, two grand. grand. I was... Maybe that must have hurt a little I bit. I might have lost a little. I lost like a little bit, not too much, not too much. Because you were bringing some back. And yeah, like, I was yeah. like breaking even. That's the cool thing with Facebook. Usually, not always or not if you're me when I was starting, but you know, if you spend a grand, you'll bring like, you know, three, four, five hundred back. You're recuperating some of it or more. But, you know, like at least you're getting something where you right. know, influencers can be a very big hit or miss. You know, yeah. like very often, I, I, I've never had too many influencer shout outs that were like, you know, spend 3K and make like right around 3K. Right. I haven't had too many that are breaking when it's either like really good or really bad, which I don't really like the toss up. Yeah, I don't, they, like, I don't like that at all. I like consistency. Yep, Daily like payouts, consistency. you know what I mean? <laughs> like consistency, if you want that, Facebook is literally the way to go. Like, yeah, now I want to point this out because actually I've been having issues with this, you know, before in the last like year or so. And oh, another sale. There you go. But people are going to probably wonder about this. So you're scaling up to big numbers. Have you had issues with payment processors? <laughs> Definitely. Of course. PayPal. PayPal. PayPal, PayPal, PayPal. Jesus Christ. But it wasn't that bad for me, though. Like, they didn't hold my stuff for too long. Probably, like, five to seven days, you know what I mean? So it wasn't too bad. <laughs> that's, that's not an <laughs> it issue. It wasn't buddy. bad at all. You but saw how much I had locked in one Stripe account earlier. It was annoying, though. Like, so you've never had Stripe? You don't use Stripe. No, I don't use Stripe. So this is what's crazy, because normally he would have had issues. You use Shopify payments. Yeah. Which is powered by Stripe. And you've used that for every single store, right? Every single store. And you've never had an issue? No issue. Like it's That crazy. amazes me. And I've made so many mistakes, you'd think I'd have an issue, but somehow, no issue. Where's the wood? I'm not going to wood. <laughs> no issue, no nothing. Like, yeah, I'm good. That's crazy, <laughs> man. Well, I guess keep doing it until it works. If it ever doesn't work, I've got a, a connection I can hook okay. up with, get you a, a real account. That, yeah, thankfully I got that solved. But there was like a, at one point, like a 40 day period where I could make zero money with Econ. Damn. And it sucked. Like shut down everything. So that was definitely not fun. But um, me and this guy right here are going to be doing a super cool thing that actually I've never really seen anyone do. But you know how I do a live stream? I've done like four of them before. Um, like a very private thing, you know, going through sharing a ton of value on Facebook ads, winning products. And I'm going to let you guys ask questions. I'm going to do that with him at the end of February. This could be a fun thing live. You're gonna be able to ask him questions as well. We're gonna run more through his story in a winning product, ad example, showing you inside of everything. So we're gonna do that for completely free, by the way. We're gonna jump on. All we ask you guys to do is go ahead, hit the button, um, or excuse me, the link down below. I'm gonna leave that, but also then hit the other link for his channel and hit the button to subscribe. Oh yeah. Okay, so subscribe to his channel. We're gonna jump on there. Um, later this month, you guys can hit that. I'll leave it as the top link, and you guys can go ahead and register your spot in there for free. We're gonna Cap the room, so it's going to be capped at the amount of people. So make sure you you know register your spot quickly, but then jump on there a few minutes early because we want to make sure that we can get to everyone's question yeah. towards the end. So that'll be a lot of fun. I appreciate you tuning on here, you guys. If you want to hear more about his, you're starting to make some YouTube videos as well, yeah. which is awesome. Definitely go ahead and check out his channel down below. With that being said, make sure to drop a like and subscribe, and we'll be seeing you on that live stream. Peace. Peace.